Hey there everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name's Chris Olmy, and today we're taking a look at Hot Brass. Now, Hot Brass isn't actually released yet, so this is a little bit of a, a beta test version that I got my hands on to see kind of what it's like. It's a top-down action um, strategy game where you play as a SWAT team, and yeah, it's kind of interesting, honestly. It's kind of interesting. It's from uh, Walk With Kings, published by Fellow Traveller. And I don't know when the release date is. But the open beta went live a couple of weeks ago. So I'm diving in to try and uh, see how this all plays out. But they do say a couple of things like, All shots are fatal, so be careful who and when you choose to uh, go that route. It's got some interesting graphics and styles and, you know, tons of different missions. You can play in different ways. There's different equipment, which might help in some situations more than others. Um, different routes through missions you can take. All kinds of things. You can play local co-op or online. Um, and yeah, you've got to hunt for suspects, arrest them, shoot them whatever it may be um it does say here though recommend play with two plus players i'm doing this on my own and so i'm really not sure i'm really not sure how this will end up honestly but let's see there we go Ooh. That's the first thing of the way. How to give sound, music, everything. Good, good. Radio chat in the background, like that. Hard style, like that. The art direction they got flashing lights and it's very simplistic, but it's it's good. It is good. Next up, settings. Share tactical effects. In fact, FPS counter controls. Subtitles. Okay, so yeah, decent option menu. So all that's really left is to dive into the gameplay, and yeah, I really don't know. I can't type apparently. Um. Reading the site. Crouch. Toggle. Let's see then how this looks and plays and feels in game and what exactly it's all about. So, okay, complete one and two to unlock next mission. Nice. So, you got an arcade mode, looks like, and missions. We're locked into missions for now. You can see here you've got your different colored um, circles, which will be 
your way of showing who's who and what kind of weapons everybody has got. Mission briefing, okay. Pretty cool. Tons of objectives and challenges. Collect all evidence while sliding. Teach his pet as soon as possible and complete the mission in two minutes. Ooh. Okay. Interesting. Looks like we've already got light armor. There's extra ones to unlock. And the door camera is the only thing we got there. Primary weapon MP5. Looks like a shotgun there to unlock. Secondary. We've got our semi automatic there. We've got flashbangs, a breaching charge, and. Is that going to be like a satchel charge or a med kit, maybe? Who knows? So it looks like that might be a, a hot pinkish color. Before we jump in, let's, let's, let's have a look at the breathing. So special weapons and training. SWAT induction facility. I know, you've done this all before and just want to see some action. Despite your confidence, our mandatory operation and engagement tutorial ensures operators understand how things are done here. Without diminishing your previous experience, it's unlikely to have prepared you for what you'll face on this job. And anyway, it's mandatory. I've seen ready for actioners who can't figure out their remaining ammunition count when the way the coast stairs and enough to elicit a suspect surrender, and what stand even stand stationary. Where's that what come from? And even stand stationary in the fatal funnel. So, love it or hate it, today's your training day. As much as for you, it's as much for your teammates as it is for you. I look forward to seeing what you've got, because obviously, you can't read. So, there we go. <laughs> it's been a long day. It's been a long day already. Um, I'm not feeling particularly well, so... Not on the top of my game with this one. Let's see just how badly this goes. But yeah, music, graphics, style, theme of the game. Um, some of the choices they made of keeping it simple graphically and where we go and how we do things is pretty good. So, aim with the mouse, move with WASD. Not too shabby. I think I'm crouching there and then I can run. Oh no, that's just walking. I look like crouch. Let me see, maybe. I don't know. Okay. There we go. Line of sight mechanics. Always enjoy those. Sprint in there. Aha, now we're going to learn how to crouch. Left control. Simples. It's a nice slide. Kind of simple to begin with. So this is the HUD. Okay. So we've got a bunch of other stuff to go through. Let's see where we've been. To unlock, to open and close, and F to smash. Picking lock. Unlocking so door. Main 
Making entry. Oh. I was gonna say, I, uh, I was holding F. But yeah, it won't let you actually do some stuff. It's all situational, I guess. Okay. Scouting under door. Scouting under door. That was pretty cool. Let me break that window for this tutorial. Just about what we can do primary, secondary. Interesting. Okay, that's kind of fun. Always checking the blind corners. So three or four is gadgets. Okay, yes. So I can see we got three of each. Okay. Okay, so that's nice and easy. Bang out. That's bright. Okay. And then the breaching charge. Placing charge. I wasn't sure kind of what the... Um, what that radius might be. Situational. Okay. So a traffic light system for enemies. So we're probably going to shoot your reds. Try and figure a way to subdue of course the neutrals in yellow and then detain the green before they change Free. get down stop get down stop okay Can't affect those ones. Stubbornness. Hands in the air. Put them up. Show me your hand. Police. Show me your hand. What? It's an interesting graphic when you hit somebody. Okay, so you've got to shout at them. Tears until they become complex. They are! So they are, they turn green. And I detain them. Hands up! Let me see your head on the ground. Hey. 
See what it puts us. Does it put us back at the start? Does it put us back here? Because maybe I was a little quick to handcuff and everything. I don't know. Maybe that's my problem. I forgot that was a toggle I should have known better should have known better <laughs> unlocking door Okay. Making it At least it's a lot quicker this time. Looking under door. simple get him back to where we were I guess I shall be make sure I press them oh Okay, so that's get down. Police on SWAT. Don't move. SWAT. Okay, so can deploy it. Just did it until that box filled up. Um, sweet. Evidence secure. Evidence secure. We were that close to the end. Oh my god. Before the game bugged out on us. <laughs> we were that close to the end. Three minutes, four seconds. Yeah. Wow. was sliding so that was right at the end we weren't sliding for that teach as pet as soon as possible not sure really what that one is and two minutes we could have done two minutes if we hadn't messed up the first bit or the game hadn't messed up why are some of those crossed out others aren't i don't know this is a work in progress this is a work in progress Look at all these missions on the map. 
you can set up I'm breaking um, so Chris Hills PD received calls from resident Adrian Poulter says that he heard at least two unidentified males breaking in and moving throughout the rear of his Thompson Road townhouse he reported to the also discussed who should hold a firearm Poulter and an adult female remain in the front of the house as they are fearful there may be more perpetrators outside Operating in a residential area poses a high risk to any surrounding citizens. The police have begun covertly evacuating neighbours where possible, but you should exercise extreme caution nonetheless. Bring order to chaos, collect all firearms and evidence, rescue Adrian Bolter. So not the female. Don't care about the female. Just Bolter. Yeah? Okay. Uh, looks like we'd have to shock someone. Surprise the unarmed hostile. So, find out maybe where they are and then smash our way in to get them before they can react. Then, try not to get shot and like take down the armed hostile inside a minute. That could be very, very interesting. With a couple of people, I can see how this could be easy. But, um, yeah. Your boy playing solo, your boy make mistakes, <laughs> who knows what's going on. Okay, so we got, oh, big window in there. Making entry. Shot a civilian. Oh, that's for them in the front of the house. Oops. Restart mission. Restart mission. <laughs> I meant to right click to shout. I was also trying to get in through the window. I was also trying to get inside the window. It, say, it says do that, but like. Making entry. Civilian spotted. I've got someone. I just kind of bleed out you a little bit. I've got someone making entry. Stop! I right clicked the show, but it wouldn't do anything. I didn't want to tease him. Okay. Okay, I think I know no. Enough about the situation to do this properly. Yeah, two people would be great. One to creep around the left hand side. Um and then make a way across the building with the other guy. And like take down the bad guy. So yeah, come in here, take this guy down, and then across and through, I guess, is the way to kind of go here. Found someone here.
Making entry. I've got someone. Put him up. Let me see your hand. I showed him one thing like beat the crap out of me. Am I supposed to just tease him? I guess I'm supposed to just tease him. Um He didn't look red to me at first. Maybe he is, maybe I'm just terrible. Who knows? <laughs> Found someone here. Making entry. Contact. Police. Detaining suspect. Spotted someone. Detaining suspect. Sweet. Evidence secured. Okay. So what am I supposed to be doing? Collecting evidence? Am I supposed to be... Oh my god, I accidentally hit... That um, I've got someone. Get down! Hands in the air! Stop where you are! Hands in the air! Stop where you are! Police on on the ground! Police on the ground! Okay, so I mean, what? Bring order to chaos. Collect all fires. Rescue agent. Put like. How do I rescue him? Stay calm. How, how do I rescue Adrian Porter? Hold on, where's this guy gone? Where's the compliant guy? Like, why is he going outside? Making entry. Stay calm. Where the, where the hell did he go? Outside for? Am I just supposed to arrest like everybody or something? Hold still. What am I resting you for? I don't know, because the, the game hasn't finished the level. Oh. So, so I was just supposed to arrest them all. Really? Okay. So where's the extra... ...stuff? extra evidence somewhere what am i missing here like i got the evidence in there i mean right clear fire arms and engines bring order to chaos so there's more people here I needed to go and clear all the rooms. It didn't say that. 
I guess that makes sense, but that, that didn't make sense to me. And it didn't make it clear that rescuing him meant arresting, arresting him, which... Yeah, something for them to work out, maybe. There we go. Get our spas. Don't mind that. Um, yeah. I think I would have done everything okay if I had just cleared out the room. I don't know if you've got to arrest him or not. But I guess you need to secure the scene. And in my case, there's one officer alone. So, four people. Put them all in handcuffs. Put them all on the ground. Make sure everything else is clear. Get every bit of evidence you can. And just wait and see. You just wait and see. Can't take any risks. But okay, that was kind of interesting. And like I say, the bit I like is the replayability of going in, figuring out better ways of doing it. That multiplayer aspect as well, where you can coordinate with other people to come in at different spots and take people down. You know? I kind of like that too. Um, I kind of like that. So I don't know how the multiplayer works. In terms of how to set it up. I guess. You can just select who you're going to be there. Um, bro, server, direct connect. Okay, so you can set up in a number of ways, which is good. Create a session. With a passport password on it so you can play with your friends okay i'm on board with that then i'm on board with that so hot brass not out yet we don't know what the likely price is gonna be but it's in a beta at the moment an open beta so you can go and check that out and yeah i say walk with kings fellow traveler game it's a really fun idea I think it works quite well, implemented quite well. It needs to explain a couple of things more. But I could see, you know, me and a couple of buddies talking on Discord, just going through these levels, laughing, crying, having a good time, blaming each other for our mistakes. All that kind of good banter and all that kind of stuff. But, um, yeah, there's all different sorts of which I'm okay with. I'm okay with. And again, I feel this is another game which is infinitely moddable. You know? There's so much that a modding community could do with it. So I'm not sure if that's going to be on the table for the game. But if it is, then kudos to them for recognizing that potential. And we'll see when it comes out exactly what this game is going to be like. But Hot Brass, keep an eye on it. This could be a very, very fun little game. So, thanks very much for watching. Appreciate it. Grab this when you can. I'll see you next time. Till then, y'all take care of yourselves. Behave. I'm going to send the boys in to come get you.